Henrietta, Oklahoma. And according to you guys, that makes this home to Troy Aikman. I gotta get out of here. Yes, I'm obviously parked in the dirt where I belong. I've been resting for 10 hours and one minute, which means <laughs> the supply chain crisis is in trouble now. Oh, the D-backs and the Braves both suck now? <laughs> I like it. Let's go Mets. My latest efforts to patch this. Westo123 has a daughter named Lauren. Lauren is currently at Fort Sill, Oklahoma. I'm also in Oklahoma. I don't know what the forge means or what that does or what she has to do, but it sounds really intense and I'm scared. Good luck to Lauren. She won't be able to see this. This is like a basic training thing. They're not allowed to have their phones unless the army's changed. If she is allowed to have her phone at basic training, then I am obligated to spend the next 35 minutes shaking my fist and complaining about how easy the younger generation has it. Happy birthday. I don't know. Is it your birthday? Who freaking knows? Okay, time to go. Ready to go forging. Same. El Reno, Oklahoma. Is this an apple crisp? Damn. Wait a minute. Joe, you are jacked. Thank you. I'm glad somebody finally noticed. <laughs> oh, important updates. Robert J from OKC is here. He promised the next time I would see him that he would give me my supersonics back to take back to Seattle with me. But I, unfortunately, I only see Robert here, but he does have his glove. So we've never been more back. Robert, do you see that? Okay, if that piece of garbage van driver would look, look at that sunrise. We get to spend that together. Is this romantic or what? First take. Robert, the sun has gotten a little bit higher, and so have my spirits, thanks to you. Thank you. I love playing catch. I love you. I love you, Robert. I'm supposed to say it first. Oh, you just ruined the whole video. <laughs> thanks a lot. There goes my guy, Robert, off into the sunrise. He's the best. He didn't clean my windshield. More importantly, he got me the non-dairy apple crisp chai on. <laughs> nope, that's pumpkin again. Either way, it's really good. Thank you, Robert. And now look, it's fuel time. Kind of funny how Robert disappears when it's time to do work. Classic Oklahoma City fan, am I right? There, that's the same. Patch still holding up, let's go. Mizzou. Texas. Totally kidding. McLean, Texas? McLean? I don't know. What? I am here for a couple of reasons. Reason number one is I'm pretty sure my AC quit working on me. And reason number two is... Uh, oh. Boopta! Seriously, I would prefer if my AC worked like it's supposed to called josh he said flip that hood open inspect for greenish oil fluid type of situation on the hoses and then give it 10 minutes hopefully it'll recharge but i'm also of the old school where we didn't have ac when i started trucking totally kidding i started trucking in 2008 local delivery boy in the pacific northwest we didn't even need ac so uh if i don't get my ac to work i will literally cease to keep living so the broken shock cord is back on this stupid load how's my patch job holding up <sighs> not good snake take that sign down there are no snakes here well i've added some glue some schmoo some bungees i got you down here most embarrassing thing i've ever done 
is text I love you sexy mama to my boss who was neither my wife nor a sexy mama. His name is Hank. <sighs> Texting Hank I love you sexy mama is now the second most embarrassing thing I've ever done. I don't even know if Western Express would hire me at this point. All right, now let's see if my AC definitely still doesn't work. Oh, Josh was right. Cycle that key. Working much better now. My floor is disgusting, I need to clean it. <laughs> Do you guys remember where you were on the day that I survived the great AC crisis? Perfect. Glen Rio, New Mexico. First things first, right off the bat, the most important thing is the AC is working. Now to the most annoying thing, shock cord is broken, that's cool. Hey Francisco, what are you doing down there? It's not that serious, bro. We have reached a state of emergency. I haven't had to throw three straps since my very first time. I didn't even know what Bob Fleet meant back then. This tarp is so cooked as the kids say. Acoma, Pueblo, New Mexico. I don't know if that's correct, so don't yell at me. This is better known as Sky City, I guess. One thing I do know is this is where we will spend the next at least 10 hours, probably more. Because I don't know about you, but I definitely don't want to start driving at 3.22 a.m. Mets are on. I've decided on what I want for dinner. I'm trying to soften up the butter first. But then I remembered, it's day four of being super jack flat better. So I better get out there and do this. So glad that I freaking, I ain't imagine I'm gonna be exercised. I'm a fitness influencer now. Shut up, Scotty K Fitness. Same. Okay, well, that's done now. Moodster cheese? That's how I do it. I guess what? This video is over now. I want to thank you for watching. And I love you guys. Orientation on Monday. And still nobody retired.